You know whose church this is? This is your church. You can sit wherever you want. It is your church, right? Yeah, it is, right? Because God shares it with all of us. How are you today? That's good. Good. Everybody's doing all right? Excellent. Excellent. I think I need a little more room. Can you guys move over? Thanks. Thank you. That's better. And then now you're too far away. Move back. Come closer. I want you to be close to me. We're all friends, aren't we? Now you're squishing. <laughs> cold in here to you? I feel a little cold to me. Is it cold to you? No. no? You're hot? I'm cold. I'm medium. You're medium? <laughs> You're hot? Isn't anybody cold like I am? No. 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 <laughs> Only your head is cold, so that's good. How about, um, how about, um, it's so early in the morning, isn't it? Yeah. Are you guys tired? No. <laughs> I am so tired. I cannot begin to tell you how tired I am. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do, Michael. I'm going to just take a nap here, and when you think we should be done with the children's sermon, wake me up and I'll say a prayer. Okay. <sighs> Look at all those people out there. You think we have enough people in church? Yeah. No, no, we need more people. I wish we had more people in church, don't you? No. <laughs> I, 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 I know, on top of everything is boring. What are you doing here? I don't even know. I don't even know. Oh, man. I'm just going to take a little nap. My alarm clock went off. Oh, already is it 7 o'clock in the morning? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. I know you guys don't complain a lot like I do. Right? You don't complain. Do you ever complain? Yeah. No. Yes. Yes. We all complain a lot. Like your mom makes something for supper or your dad makes something for supper and, and puts it out on the table and you go, ew, why do I have to eat that? You do that, right? Yeah, I know. I know. I used to do that when I was a kid. I don't do it now because I cook, so how can I complain? I put food out there, right? Or, uh, or when you have to do, if you guys have chores at home, you don't want to do your chores. Why do I have to do that? I know, about I that? My mom just do that. Why can't she just do that? I don't know. How <laughs> young you can't just do that? <laughs> you don't have anything else to do during the day. Come on. Really? But here's the good part, though. Because even though we complain, I know that we all say thank you a lot, too, right? <laughs> Whoops. Maybe we don't. Like, like when you get supper and there are Brussels sprouts on the plate. I know, Brussels sprouts are disgusting. It said, in fact, it says in the Bible that Brussels sprouts are disgusting. And yucky, it says they're disgusting and yucky. We don't have any Brussels sprout farmers in the congregation. But, but but what if you're what if you get on your plate Brussels sprouts yucky and like chicken really good chicken right mm, like fried chicken the chicken on the floor no chicken fries you oh that's right you guys are vegetarians I forgot so what do you, so what do you like to eat pasta pasta there you go all right so let's say you get Let's, oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Let's say you get Brussels sprouts and pizza. Um, yes, yes. I like pizza. You like everything? That's wonderful. You never complain? Fantastic. That's so good. You eat all your dinner. Very good. And when you're done, you say, Dad, Mom, thank you so much for a good dinner, right? Well, sometimes we forget to do that, right? Or when you get up in the morning and you get to put on some nice clothes and they're all clean, you go, Mom, Dad, thanks so much for doing the laundry and making sure I have clean clothes, right? That's good. You're supposed to use it. So, you know what? I know we complain sometimes, but it's also important to say thank you all so that our parents know 
that we appreciate what they're doing for us. So I have a challenge for you. Does anybody want to take a challenge? Me. Good, good. Here's your challenge. How many fingers do you have on one hand? Five. How many days a week do you go to school? Five. Five. So this is easy, right? For each day that you go to school, I want you to at least say thank you to your mom and dad for one thing, okay? Just for one thing, even if that's all you can think of. And, wait, we're not done yet. Also, I'd like you to say thank you to God for one thing every day, okay? One thing. Can you do that? Once a day for five days. Thank, thank you to your parents and thank you to God. Start tomorrow. You can start today. <laughs> today too. Your parents won't complain and God won't complain. They'll be happy. Today's school tomorrow. Yes. No, tomorrow's school. Are you complaining? Say thank you God for school. It helps me learn and be smart. How's that sound? Good. Five different things. A different thing every day. That shouldn't be too hard. I'm sure you'll think of something. Yeah, I think I will too. I, I knew you would. I knew you would. Good. How about you guys? You gonna think of something to say thank you to your mom and dad for? Yeah, I already know. Mm -hmm. Okay. Some, something and something to thank God for. Okay. Okay. So, so if you think of two things in a day, you can save them and then think of something new for the next day. Okay. I mean, you can say whatever you're thinking then. How about that? I know. I'll help you do this. We're gonna say a prayer. How about we say a prayer and we'll thank God for all the good things we have. Okay. Let's pray. Dear God, we know that sometimes we complain too much. And yet, you give us all these good things. You give us this church where we can come and worship and learn about you and about your son Jesus. You give us homes and families and friends and school and all kinds of good things. You give us good food that we love to eat and, and lots of things that we enjoy doing. You give us our bodies that are strong and growing. And for all these things, we thank you. Most of all, we thank you for that best gift, this, your son Jesus, who loves us for all time. So help us to say thank you to others because they bring you to us. For this we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, guys. Good job. Thanks for coming up. Oh, oh, oh.